Tonight, the hunt is on for the driver who ran over a cyclist early Saturday morning, killing him. Luke Jones has what we know about the crash and how the victim is being remembered. I kept knocking on his door, but I didn't get any answer. Stephen Proctor's first indication, something was terribly wrong. His neighbor of three years had gone silent. I was seeing when I come in from work, and we would talk briefly. Then yesterday, the answers he'd been looking for. They was talking about a guy who got hit on the bike. That man was none other than Proctor's neighbor, 37-year-old James Towns. Police say he was riding along West North Bend Road near Edward Avenue around 1 a.m. Saturday when a car slammed into him. The driver never stopped. Well, he was a good friend of mine. He, I really, I'm going to miss him. I am going to miss him. A man who he says enjoyed time with himself. He was a quiet guy. He stayed to himself. As much as he enjoyed time with friends. We would barbecue out there together. A man with many passions, but few approaching his love of those trusty two wheels he relied on. He ride the bike everywhere. He ride it all the time. Snow, rain, it didn't matter. He ride that bike. And Proctor's convinced that somewhere out there, he's still riding. I hope you're doing well up in heaven. In College Hill, Luke Jones, Local 12 News. And if you have any information that could help police, call Crime Stoppers. As always, that number is 513-352-3040. You will remain anonymous and you could get cash for your clues.